See, I told you, polychlorinated biphenyls, and a lot of it. Yeah, yeah, very exciting. Can we go back now? All we need now is a core sample. Professor Jones is gonna kill us for snaking her stuff. Not if we find the dump site. Oh. Here, Shankali. Hey, hey, I'm not climbing down into any caves. Forget it, babe. That's it. We're going back. Oh, Revy. Come on, baby. It won't take too long. Those caves go down pretty deep, you know. Oh, yeah? Very deep? I like that. Yeah, deep and very dark. Really? The PCPs are off the chart here. Nitrates, selenium, we got it! Ravi? Ravi? Ravi, it's not funny. So we through with work yet? Well, maybe a little break wouldn't hurt. Or maybe a long one. What the? David Stone. Jakey. Dude, how the hell are you? Oh, man. You missed an excellent climb in Nepal. Sheer face, all the way up. It's wicked. You would have loved it. Uh, thanks, Carlton. That'll be all. Very good, sir. Adios, Jeeves. Sorry about all this. Uh, things are a little formal around here. Shelly's parents are high society types. I know. Whatever. It's New Hampshire. I'm surprised they let me in through the gates. So, where's the creamy new bride to be? Uh, she'll be down later. She's putting her face on. That'll be a while then. <laughs> Does the face come with a new personality? Or is it the same uptight ice princess I love so well? Funny. How about a little respect, huh? Sorry. It's as little as I could come up with. Hmm. You know, despite what you think, Shelley does like you. Bullshit. Hmm. It's a new you, huh? I liked you better in khakis and a bandolier. Well, all you had to give up was some quality time with your old buddies. But you've wanted this for a long, long time. And now, in three months, you will be Master Stone of New Hampshire. Or do you have to take the family name? No, I believe I keep the name. I just changed my tailor. So I guess we should talk about the bachelor party? Yes, we should. Look, I don't want to disappoint you, but I'd really prefer not I to. I know. I know. No strippers. Hardly seems like a bachelor party. There is a tradition at stake here. I know. 
and I realize it's my duty as a red-blooded American male to subject myself to the temptation of naked women prior to a lifelong commitment of monogamy. But I... Actually, you're more of a blue blood now, so I don't think it counts against you. However, my brilliant minds devised a much more suitable temptation for you. Ready? I'm afraid to ask. Caving. We're going caving? That's right, buddy. One last great thrill ride before you're consumed with routine and normalcy. But I'm not talking about that Carlsbad bullshit. I'm talking about real caving. An adventure to remember. Here, in India. A very radical cave, I'm told. Just outside Hyderabad, the Shantali Caverns. Maybe eight people in history have climbed all the way to the bottom. Goes down a good three miles or so. And the best part is, everyone can go. Yeah, all the guys? Even Matt? Yeah, I'm helping him out. But what the hell? This is our last time together as a group. I mean, as the old group? As the guys? A challenge has been put before you, Mr. Stone, if you choose to accept. Hell yeah, let's do it. Welcome to India, Mr. Bond. I thought you said just the guys. What? Sarah's one of the guys. That's why you broke up with her, remember? Well, well, Mr. Doggett. <laughs> it's been a while. I can't believe they finally let you out to play. And we figured you were uh, grounded for life. No, that happens in three months. Ha uh ha. -huh. Hello, Sarah. Uh, dude, you can kiss her. It's cool. Didn't know you two were still together. Yeah, we're still together. Hey! The boys! Together! Again! This is gonna be one awesome trip. I can feel it. Even with Matt along. Hey, Derek. You promised? Okay, it's cool. I'll leave him alone. Good. But if he starts whining about his damn back again... Hey! Just hand with the luggage, huh? Dirk seems the same. Brash and lovable as always. He's certainly brash. You know, I have to admit, it is a little odd. It's the first time I've seen everybody since you two hooked up. Kind of changes the dynamic of the group, you know? Does it? Hello. It's not awkward for you, is it? It's not like you still have feelings for me. No, I don't. Not like that. Okay, then. Good. <laughs> so, how's the little stick back home? She's fine, thanks. And she's not a little stick anymore. Oh, no. Did she get fat? No, Sarah, she did not get fat. She will. You too, dude. What's up, dog? And I bet Dirk you wouldn't show. <laughs> Excellent, dude. Welcome back. Hi, David. Remember me? Very funny, Matt. Of course I do. Yeah, that was funny, huh? <laughs> this is awesome. Congratulations, by the way. Oh, well, thanks. You know, I... You know, Things are going really well with me, too. Work, everything. Except, of course, I have a back issue. Hey, let's all get to the hotel, huh? Big day tomorrow. Okay. Get your stuff. Oh. I'm hungry. The staples of the Indian cuisine are potato, mutton, and curd. Yeah, potato, mutton, and curd. Yeah, potato, mutton, and curry. Yeah, I'm not wearing any underpants. <laughs> oh, you think that's fun? Oh. Oh. Wait, I got it in. <laughs> 
pretty good to be back here with you nut jobs. Namaste. Welcome to Shankali. Are you the guy? Yes, sir. I am Cafe. You know we're going caving, right? Yes, indeed, I know, sir. I'm ready. The question is, are you? Shankali is as ancient as the sands. Some say it is a mouth to the underworld. The legend of Shankali spans time eternal, as endless as the black caverns themselves. A place of death and despair, a doorway to another world of demons. Many men have entered, few have returned alive. <laughs> You're bullshitting us, right? Yes, I think so. The story is a requirement by the Board of Tourism. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, God. Okay. <laughs> I believe uh, that. Well, you would. <laughs> hey, what's up with your brother? Oh, <laughs> that's really funny. Last year, he was partying with some of his uh, med school geek friends, and he had this real bad trip, you know? The one where you hallucinate there's bugs all over your skin? Mm. Yeah, ever since then, he's had his irrational fear of insects. It's excellent. Hey, you all right over there, Doc? I hate bugs, man. They suck. You hear that? Y'all suck. Beautiful out here. Peaceful and tranquil. It's a perfect place for the guys. <laughs> it's great to have David back, don't you think? It seems like old times. Sure, Jake. Should be fun. You guys get a chance to catch up or whatever? I know what you're trying to do. I know you do. And I love you for that, but my feelings for David left a long time ago. No, they didn't. Yeah, Jake, they did. Right around the time you left me, remember? I can't bullshit a bullshitter, sweetheart. I know you still care for him. And if you remember, you're far too spirited back then to settle down. Well, he's found someone else to play it safe with now anyway, so it doesn't really matter, does it? I always felt that David lost his spirit when he left you. He lost that thrill for the moment, that reckless, selfless abandon that makes being in love so exciting. I hope that doesn't happen to us all.
I see you! <laughs> she loves me. Night vision. Very useful. Oh, here. These are cool, too. They're tiny transponders. One for each of us. You can track everyone with them. Which is good if those guys try to ditch me. You know, my dad would kill me if he knew I was here with you. You know, you, you gotta get out from under his shadow someday, Matt. It's not healthy. Yeah. I know, I will. I will. I will. Is this a girdle? <laughs> yeah, it's for my back. I'm sure it looks great on you, Matt. Oh! Dark. <laughs> you asshole. This is not funny. It's just a joke, man. <laughs> that was excellent, man. Really excellent. Shut up, Putz. Last race of sunlight, kids. We're going in. You doing okay? Yeah, sure. Come on. We repel from here, 670 feet, straight down. There's an outcropping below that lead us into some truly spectacular caverns. Wow, looks pretty hairy, dude. Excellent, I'm first. Why don't we let David go? It's his party after all.
You're not gonna let her show you up like that. Not again. Watch this. Woohoo! Yeah. <laughs> you haven't lost your touch. Neither of you. Thanks for the push up there, huh? No problem. Pardon me. I don't like heights. I took the steps. Congratulations, my friends. We've reached the bottom of Shankali. You are now more than three miles below the surface of the Earth. Oh, wow. wow. Yeah. Yeah. The pressure at this depth has made this igneous almost completely non-porous. Excellent.
right, guys. Very funny. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 wait a second, wait a second. That's not it. So... <laughs> So, oh, yeah. so this guy, <laughs> this guy, is, he's stuck in his skis. No. He can't break the super glue shit, and he's putting his seat far enough back so he can drive in. <laughs> I did something like that once. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Jake, sir, please hit me again with your best shot. You pee on me, you're dead. Who's there? Zoe. Miss around, trying to focus. God. Sarah, you gotta do the dance. Yeah, come on, do the dance. Please, for David.
Ah. <coughs> Okay? Not really. Okay. <coughs> 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 I was like a six point eight. Yeah, definitely like a six point eight. You're over it. Zoe, stop digging, all right? It's a waste of time. All right, there must be another way out, yes? Say yes. Well, there are several other passages, but I've never tried. Hey, how far does this go down? Uh, perhaps a hundred feet? Perhaps a mile? I don't know. Quick freaking guide, man. Well, the caves below this point have never been charted. We are as deep as any man has ever gone. Aren't you supposed to be prepared for this kind of thing? I mean, you don't even have a damn radio on now, Yeah, well, do neither you? do we, Dirk, all right? Let's just back off. Hey, but I know where my team is, all right? Buried three miles underground. I don't need to radio my own team, do I? Where's his? It's supposed to have backup. Right, Gaddafi? Yeah, Dirk! All right, everyone, just cool it. Here's where we're at. If this fissure goes down far enough, we should be able to get under the slide and cut back up through that slice we saw on the north side. Okay? Let's go. Yeah. Hey, where's Matt? Last time I saw him, he went to pee. Matt! Matt! Matthew! Matt! Hey, Matt! 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 Matt, where, where are, are you? What? I got him, he's right here. No shit, what the hell happened to I him? I don't know, I mean, they look like, like stab wounds, or, I mean, they're linear and symmetrical. It's almost like a... Like what, like, like bite marks? I don't know. Can bats do that? Uh, I don't think so. Freaking rocks bit him, dude. Okay, stalactites or something. That's enough, all right? Let's get out of here, right now. what we've got. Eight cords, 400 foot. Two web slings we don't need. Compass, flare gun, whatever. Fuck. Our pretzels are burned and the ascension pulleys are back behind us. We're screwed. So we rough it. At least we got lights. This is really weird, guys. All right, I found someone's hand pilot back there. It's got all this chemical breakdowns listed under Shankali. It's data last week. Yeah, that's really weird, dude. 
No, what's weird is that there's these references to 5-hydroxytryptamine and cytolicin. <sighs> right, those are poisons, insect poisons. And whoever this was found a ton of it down here. What, like pesticide? No, like a venom. All right, it's almost certainly from an arthropod and most likely from the Scolopendra gigante genus. All right, those are the big poisonous centipedes. Yeah, bugs. Faster than me. You go. Don't tell the others I said that. Sarah, how you doing? Good. Great. Thanks. Looks like I'm gonna beat you to the bottom again. This one doesn't count. Just take your time. I'm right behind you. As always. Are we going to have to do this? That was not the way you learned how to spider. from the school to be there. Rake has been obsessed with this illegal dump site ever since that report came out. It's not like we've had a cave-in last night. Vijay, better call Kafi and bring in some diggers. You really think they've gone down there? That's what was circled on the map in the jeep. I think someone else is down there too. Vijay, forget Kafi. I think he's already in here. Very strange rock here. Like nothing I've seen before. Yeah. The slime stone could be from the advent of the tertiary period. That's like 65 million years old. Who cares, dork? Whoa. Who ordered the tough guy? and nooks and crannies. Yeah? Just gotta go up.
sheer size of it. Okay, Dirk, Sarah, Owen, you guys head north. Jake, Zoe, and I'll head south. Look for an upshaft. Copy? Stay here with the box. Keep an eye on everyone. We'll meet back here in an hour and see what we got, okay? All right, let's go. Oh, dude, I wonder how hey, many shut up. Go... Hey, guys, over here. This might go up. I feel a draft. Okay, I'll go. Don't give me your macho shit now, Dirk. I'm afraid you were going to say that. Means we dig. Dig? But we don't even know they're in there. It could take days. Need up. Let me get you out of here, bro. Just like always, right? Hey down there! Gets pretty tight, but I think I see an exit! <sighs> you were scared. <laughs> it was not. It was alert concern. <sighs> Asshole. <laughs> you were scared. Asshole. Great. 
We lost our friggin' guide. Well, we better find him, bro. He's got the tracker. Sorry, my cave's looped back around. What the hell is that? Oh, this is so nasty. We gotta get out of here, all right? We have to get everyone to that shaft. We have to get out of here right now, man. What, what happened? What? He saw some insects or something, right? No, these weren't just ordinary insects, okay? I mean, there's, they're, they're, I just saw the larvae, but these things were big, man. I mean, they're huge, and there's like a whole hive of them. Oh, and just calm down, you know? It's probably just some weird maggot or something. These, God, these aren't just little maggots? Oh, you just listen to me for once in your life? Okay, these things are voracious, man. There's like a body there or something. They were all over it, all right? We have to get out of here right now, man, okay? Right now! Shit! Where's Zoe? Zoe, too? Zoe! Zoe! I got her! Thank God. You got her? Where is she? Straight ahead, 50 yards. She's coming this way. Zoe, get over here! Get out of there! Zoe! 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 What's wrong? Zoe? Zoe? Zoe! Zoe, answer me! Hey, maybe she can. Those things got her. Wait, you said something about a way out, right? Go there. I can find you with this. I'm gonna see if she needs help. Me too. I'm going too. Don't! Just get going. We'll be right behind you. Go! Come on, let's go! Come on!
This is because of that husk of skin or whatever. It was a shedding. Nothing I know sheds that big. Zoe? Zoe, answer me! Be quiet. She could be hurt! Zoe! Think! Zoe! Where is she? We're right on top of her. Poison's on that list, and, and that, that... No! Body. No! Go! No! Run! This is it! Go! Go, 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 go! What are you doing? Sarah, want to get down there? Come on, Rose. All right, let's move. Come on. Come on. Light on. Me? You're not facing? Yes, go, go, go. Come on, guys. Kathy, go. Come on, guys. Let's move. Oh, I can't move me. No, dude, you go. Go, man. Hold up the line. Go. I got this, man. Go. I got this. Just here. Dude, I'm not stuck in. Everybody keep it down. Some kind of huge centipede. Like you said, Owen, but I mean huge. I told you. You mean like the thing that bit Matt? Yeah, yeah, probably. Quiet. All right, can we get moving up there? Can we get this line moving? Use this to map underground topography. If we are lucky, we might be able to find them. What are those? Is that them? I can't tell yet. Give it some time. Let's see if they move. Chief, I was just thinking if there's some kind of radio rocking device, I might be able to find their frequency or at least send them a message that we are here. We might even be able to guide them in conjunction with the sonar machine. Good, good. Maybe you should get hit in the head more often. Go! Hello? This is Deputy Vijay of Dhari Police Department. Can anybody hear me on this frequency? Anyone at all? No? Okay. Hello? This is Deputy Vijay of Dhari Police Department. Thank you. Yeah, whatever. 
I guess you're lucky we're here to help you out. Leave him alone, Dirk. He saved my ass back there. Yeah, well, he hasn't done much for the rest of us. What is it exactly that you want me to do? It would have been nice if you told us about the giant caterpillars. Dirk, stop. How is he Dirk. supposed to know about those? Shut. Listen. You hear that? That's a radio. Can anyone hear me on this band? Anyone at all? Can anyone tell where it's coming from? Sounds like it's getting closer. Someone's coming to get us? Hello? Excellent! Oh shit! Jake, help! Oh, oh. Dirk. 
Where were you, man? I was right there. I'm sorry. I was with you. You were supposed to be watching him. I tried. I almost got killed. Where were you, man? Where were you? Where were you? You're not my fucking responsibility. <laughs> <sighs> Long. I think this may be the end of the line. Hey, the water is flowing here. You see? It's moving. All right, coffee. We're in business. As long as it doesn't just seep back down. Out. One tug good, two tugs bad. Watch the bubbles. If they stop for more than 20 seconds, we pull them back. Mr. Jake. Yeah? I don't know swimming. Hello, hello. I think I found them. Come, come, come. Now, see these hits? They came back. They've moved some distance. I'm probably picking up their helmets, backpacks, or something. Thank God. We need to find an alternate route from their position. Get me all the geological survey maps you can get your hands on. Okay, sir. Come on. Hello? Maps, maps. No bubbles. No bubbles. I know. I know. my fault. I brought him. I brought him here. It's not your fault. We're all here. How am I supposed to face my mother and, and tell her that Hey! <laughs> 
Oh. Oh, this is not good. The damn thing won't die. Thanks. Now there's two of them. And those two halves. Comprende? Come on, let's just get moving. Yeah. Hey, maybe, maybe can't swim. We'll huh? wait and see, Taffy. Let us know. I've had enough from you, Mr. Dark. I cannot take this anymore. <laughs> Mr. Dark, you are a bastard! Stop you bastard! Suggestions. Oh, we can throw Taffy in and see if it's still there. <laughs> Just kidding, man. We could drop something. What should we drop? I don't know. How about a shoe? Hey! How about this? There's no way we can use this. Well, we can't just hang here forever. And who's got Matt's tracker? I do. It's not working before. Shit! We're clear! It's like a mile away. Sorry, man. Do you know which way that thing went? Yeah. Yeah, that way. That's not right. That's the way it came. He must be reading it wrong. Yeah? You want to read it, genius? Wait, wait, wait a sec. You cut that thing in half, right, dude? Yeah. I... Oh, shit! Ah! Ah! Things fried. No way. It ate a radio. How nasty is that? Wait, sir, I. Wash your hands. Hello, is there anybody out there? Hello. Hello. Hello, hello. Is there anyone there? 
Is that you, Jira? I told you never to call me on this. This is Zero Connell. I'm one of the five climbers trapped in a cave-in. I've made contact! They must go north. Not far from their position, they will come to a rise with a narrow passage. A crack in the rock will lead them to the other side. There is a passage that connects to some old storage cave which have not been used in decades. Right over here. But inside there is an access tunnel that leads to the surface. There is a door that we have to dig it open. Hit that button. Hello? Yes. Hello? Yes. We're at the rise. We'll contact you when we get to the other side. Should we tell them about the centipede thing? They'll think we're crazy. Yeah, it's dead. Just forget about it. We'll tell them about it when we get up there. Yeah. Come on. Hey, it's coming! Move your ass! Go! Go! Come on! Come on! Sorry, Professor. Be moving north toward the escape point. I just hope you find the damp tunnel before nightfall. Look at that. No, this way, this way. Where's David? Access door. It is supposed to be in this uh, vicinity. In the vicinity? Find the damn door. Before we lose our light. This must be what those other cavers were looking for. Rescuers do their job. VJ, are you there? Yes, yes, I'm here. Go ahead. VJ, it's Jake Hauser. Yes, go ahead. Listen, we made it, but we lost two of our team coming through. It's only three of us now. And there's something you should know. There's something else down here with us.
Are you inside the bunker yet? Yes, but it's a bit of a mess. This toxic shit spilled everywhere. Good, good. You are supposed to go to the southwest corner where you will find an access tunnel. There is a large door at the other end. That's the door out. That's the door, and where is that? Oh, no. That is storage bunker is exactly what Professor John's students were looking for. An illegal dump site. I don't know anything about it. I didn't even know if it was there until a couple of hours ago. It was sealed and buried when I was still in school. Don't worry. If it's illegal, you can be sure. I'll raise some hell. Hell has already been raised. You want budget? I can't budge this damn door. This one's big. Real big. We gotta get out of here. Hold the blast, we're not ready. Wait! Hold the blast! They are not clear! 
Okay. Wait right here. What are you doing? Save it! Save it! No! Stop it! Sarah! No! Get back! Now, blast it! I am Chief Kumar. And I am very glad to see you. So? So. Guess the wedding's on.
always wanted to do that. <laughs> That's it. No more adventures.